takeout machine and all the accessories, including three rubber hoses, one pack of big cotton filter, one pack of small cotton filter, one accessory bag, three pairs of twist cups of big, middle, and small size, three pairs of cupping cups of big, middle, and small size, three pairs of face cups of big, middle, and small size, two pairs of cleansing cups for face and tea zone, one pair of private cups, three grease cups. There are two spare fuses in the accessory bag that can be replaced if the fuse inside the device breaks down. When the fuse is broken, slowly pry the fuse with the screwdriver and remove the broken one. Take out the spare fuse and install it for replacement. The big and small white rubber rings in the accessory bag are replacement for the ring and filter of the device. They can be used to replace when the ring and the filter is broken. Take out the filter. You will see the small ring on it, which can be replaced. Unscrew the filter. You will see the big ring, which can be replaced. Insert the filter in the correct direction to ensure the proper function. Install the power cord. The medium white rubber ring in the accessory bag is the replacement for the ring and the inlet. Unscrew the knob of the inlet. You will see the rubber ring which can be replaced when it is broken. Please note, the outlet is on the left of the device and the inlet is on the right of the device. Unscrew the knob of the inlet. You will see the cotton filter. The cotton filter here should be changed once a week. The replacing ones are big ones. Turn on the device. Test the suction. Press the switch to turn it on. Select M1 mode. Twist the section knob to the right to increase the section to the max. Put your finger on the inlet. If you feel being sucked, tighten it. Then the device can be used in normal function. When using the grease cup, the cotton filter must be installed before operation. Unscrew the handle and put cotton filter inside. Then screw the handle tightly. There are three grease cups. The big one is for the big area on body. The middle one is for arms and legs. The small one is for face, neck, and small areas. When operating the grease cup, insert one end of the white rubber hose into the inlet and insert the other end into the end of the grease cup. Select the mode according to one's specific condition. There are four modes. It is advised to select M2 for the first time of use. The working time is advised to be around 15 minutes. Please note, the interface for the cupping cup, grease cup, and grease cup is the same one. Essence should be applied evenly to the operating area. Adjust the section according to one's feeling. Twist the knob to the left to decrease the section and twist it to the right to increase the section. The section is advised to be low for the first time of use to avoid causing pain. If you need clearing damp, detox, scrubbing, and shaping, you can select manual adjustment mode. Make it to the constant section mode. It is advised to adjust the section time to 5 to 15. The bigger the number is, the longer the section will be. The release time is advised to be 0 to 5. If it is 0, means it is in constant section mode. After the operation, clean the grease cup, unscrew the handle, take off the dirty cotton filter, and place a new one in the handle.
when using the vacuum cups, insert one end of the rubber hose into the inlet and insert Y shaped end into the two vacuum cups separately. There are nine pairs of vacuum cups, three pairs of cupping cups, three pairs of face cups, two pairs of cleansing cups, one pair of private cup. Select the proper one according to your skin condition. The working time is advised to be around 15 minutes. It is advised to choose M2 mode for the first time of use. Select the manual mode. The cupping time is advised to be 10 to 15 minutes. The section time is advised to be 5 to 15. The bigger the number is, the longer the section will be. The release time is advised to be 0 to 5. If it is 0, means it is in constant section mode. Tap to start. Essence should be applied evenly to the operating area. Both capping cups should be contacted with the skin fully at the same time when operating. When using one glass bottle only, one of the tubes and the one end of the Y-shaped rubber hose needs to be tied to avoid air leakage. Thus, you can use only one vacuum cup to operate. Clean the glass bottle with the same line after the operation. When using the breast cups, insert one end of the rubber hose into the inlet and insert the Y-shaped end into the two breast cups separately. The working time is advised to be 20 to 30 minutes. It is advised to select manual mode. Adjust the section time to 5 to 13. Adjust the release time to 0. The section can be adjusted according to one's thing. The technique of operation of breast cups is as the same as the cupping cups. That is, both cups need to be contacted with the skin fully at the same time. Then the section is produced. If only one cup contacts with the skin, will lead to air leakage. It can be used with essence or breasts enhancement products. There are three pairs of breasts cups. Select the proper one according to your size of breasts. Clean the breasts cups with the same line after operation. <laughs>